Hello and welcome to our first Dreamweaver website design project. In this series you'll learn how to build a complete website from start to finish using Dreamweaver CS6. You can use your own images and resources for this project or if you prefer you can download all of the project files shown in these tutorials. You can also get the complete series manual in printed or ebook format along with the high definition video tutorials from wizzybooks.com. In this lesson, we're going to insert the banner picture. On the finished version, you can see that we've got this animation effect where it's fading from one picture to the next. This is achieved using JavaScript, and we'll be looking at how to do that in future lessons. So for now, we're just going to put a single image into the banner as a placeholder for when we want to continue and create the animation. So I'm going to switch back to Dreamweaver and I'm going to open the main HTML document. If we scroll down in the code window, we'll come to the banner section. So we've got the opening and closing banner div just there. And this is nothing different to what we've done before. We've already inserted some pictures, so we just need to insert one of the pictures from the banners folder. So I'll press tab and we'll start off with the image tag, space, and source or src press enter browse will appear press enter again and we're currently still in the icons folder so we need to come up one level so that we can find the folder that we're after this is it this folders inside the image folder and it's the fading banner folder so I'll double click that one to open and if I click on banner one you'll see the image that we're going to be inserting in the preview pane here. So I'll say OK. And then I need to finish off the image tag with a space, forward slash, and a closing angle bracket. I'll come across the design view and click, and then you'll see that banner image appear. So I'll save it at this point, choosing File and Save. And again, we can press F12 to preview our web page. So there's the banner picture inserted. And as I say, we'll be animating that banner in future lessons. If you found this series of videos helpful and you want to receive updates on video tutorials as they're released, why not subscribe to my channel? And don't forget to like and share it with your friends.